Gorongosa National Park in Mozambique is one of Africa's most celebrated wildlife restoration stories. In 2008, there were only 10,000 large animals. Today, nearly 100,000. The predators are returning too, a sure sign of ecosystem health. A decade ago, Gorongosa had only a few lions, now well over a hundred. And for the first time in decades, wild dogs hunt Gorongosa's growing population of antelopes. But the Gorongosa project isn't just about restoring this iconic national park. Inspired by the vision of Nelson Mandela and Mozambique's former President Chisano, there's a deep commitment that the park will benefit local communities. Gorongosa provides jobs. Over 600 people work here. And tourism creates skilled employment opportunities for Mozambicans. The park operates mobile clinics, trains and supplies community health workers, and delivers many other critical health services that reach over 100,000 people. Commercial agriculture projects run by the park, such as Rainforest Coffee on Mount Gorongosa, lay the foundation for sustainable economic growth around the park. As Nelson Mandela said, education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. So the park works with the government of Mozambique to improve the quality of local schools, with a special focus on keeping vulnerable girls in school, giving them the same choices and opportunities as the boys. And every year, the park brings thousands of local school kids into Gorongosa to meet their wild neighbors. Some of these children will become the future guardians of Gorongosa. To help them and other young Mozambicans get the knowledge they'll need, the park provides training, support and mentorship to the country's next generation of scientists. Gorongosa even offers a master's degree in conservation biology, taught entirely inside the park. By combining wildlife conservation with large-scale, long-term community development, the government of Mozambique and Gorongosa are showing the world an inspiring example of what a national park can be.